The Steel Horse Rally back in downtown Fort Smith this weekend for the ninth year in a row. KNWA's Brianna Moore spoke with law enforcement and event organizers about what you should know. Brianna. Yes, well, I spoke to the president of the rally who tells me after nine years, they're still aiming to benefit the local community and honor those that serve. If you can keep a dry eye when you come around to Garrison Avenue, you're a bigger man than I am because it's, it's a lot of fun and it all happens Saturday, well, Friday, May the 3rd and Saturday, May the 4th. This is Dennis Snow, the president of the 2024 Steel Horse Rally. Snow says that it took him nearly two decades to make this event a reality. You know, to actually become a reality. Uh, there's so many people that work so hard on this. Uh, first of all, our volunteers. We've had thousands of people who don donate their time, talents, and efforts. Uh, they really are the fuel for the rally each and every year. Snow says the event is dedicated to all who serve. Law enforcement, veterans, active military, and first responders. But they also make charitable donations to three local charities, all while having fun doing it. It's a win, win, win. We're all involved, and we thank all involved. According to Snow, last year's rally had a $25 million economic impact on the Fort Smith community. Well, hopefully downtown Fort Smith and all of Fort Smith and downtown businesses appreciate the economic impact. Event attendees can participate in events like a motorcycle parade that will be led by vintage bikes, a strongman weightlifting competition, welcome parties, live entertainment, and more. We've got a little bit of different music styles for everybody. Uh, the music starts at 6.30 p.m. on Friday night, and it starts at noon on Saturday. Snow tells me the city will shut down the heart of Fort Smith, Garrison Avenue, for the event this weekend. I spoke with Captain Stephen Creek from the Fort Smith Police Department Patrol Special Operations Division about the traffic impact. Basically, Garrison Avenue from 5th Street all the way down to where it intersects with Rogers is going to be closed off. Uh, detour routes will be Rogers Avenue around Garrison, and also North B and, and A Streets will get you around the event area to the east and west. Captain Creek also encourages event goers to consider your sunscreen and just keeping yourself safe while the sun's out. It's a lot warmer than it has been in the recent months. Stay aware. There's a lot of motorcycles uh, up and down the avenue. The rally will be taking place right here on Garrison Avenue this Friday and Saturday. We will have that event schedule over on our website, knwa.com. But for now, I'm going to send it back over to you at the desk. All right, Brianna.